do the monthly recommendations this month. This month's theme is required reading. I only read one book in school. I know it's a shocker, but I never really had to read any others. Like, they weren't a big part of my learning and syllabus, but there is one that I read that I will recommend. But I've got four books that I think should be recommended reading. So I'm going to recommend them as if they were in a class. So I'm excited. The one book that I had to read for recommended reading was The Book Thief by Marcus Uzak. And this is a book that everyone needs to read. It is narrated by death and it just talks about the story in such an interesting way. Having this point of view that like isn't for or against the war or for or any character, like he enjoyed going to see Liesl and all that, but it's just so beautiful and he talks about the story so well and it's just an interesting mindset that Marcus Uzak was able to get into to write this book and I definitely recommend it, even though it's very sad, but I recommend it and it does a good job of showing how the war was in this time as well. That's for the recommended reading and now onto the books that I think should be recommended reading. So the first one is The Hate You Give by Andrew Thomas and this is a book that would really show off the Black Lives Matter movement and the police brutality. It would be a good book for modern issues in the world and to be get people really more into it and by having it as a fictional story really helps as well but I think this book would be good to analyse. It's got a lot of nice writing, a lot of good text and definitely just would show those issues in a very good light that really is informative and also has just a great kick-ass character and a great plot. The next one I'd like to recommend is Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor and the reason for this is because it was a very beautifully written book and it would be good for like showing off very nice English. I love the story, it's a great book about angels and all that stuff, it's really really good, it's hard to explain without like spoiling anything of the plot but it's just Lainey Taylor has such beautiful writing that there's so much that you could analyse and bring out and so many different things in English that it would be really good to learn more about your English and how you speak and write with this book. The next book I'd like to recommend is What We Saw by Aaron Hartzler and it really shows how bad the rape culture actually is in the world and it would be a very good way to, again to show people like it would be a good book to kind of use as a like this is what can happen and what you can do and the way people react like I definitely think it would be a good book to like you know stop people drinking a lot of parties and getting hurt and what you need to do and how to make sure stuff like this does not happen to you so I definitely recommend this one. And the last book I'd like to recommend is Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe by Benjamin L. Sanze because it shows a beautiful relationship between two boys and how life was for them back at this time and I just think it would be a really good one to see like how times change for the gay community and how like it impacted their lives and what they really did and having it happen to someone from such a young age and it's got a lot of awards so it'd be a good one to read but it's really beautifully written as well and I definitely recommend reading this even if you never have to read it as a required reading just read it anyway but it definitely is a good book at showing off issues again so here are the books that I'd like to recommend because they are all awesome and I love them so much but anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you guys later bye